nobody wants to stand in the way of change, obviously, right? But but what what are we valuing in, in this change? What are we considering for future generations in this change? Um, you know, I grew up in the city. I grew up in the Bronx, and uh, <laughs> yes, put me down. <laughs> um, and so for me, I, I feel the tension of sort of both sides of this narrative of gentrification of people being uh, newcomers and oldcomers. You know, I, in a sense, am an old, old uh, comer or whatever, old resident, old timer. Yeah. <laughs> and but I'm moving into a neighborhood where it's affordable for me to live in, and and then you're labeled a, a gentrifier for two people. Also, for me, it's a, it's a very personal thing. And every other week, I'm looking into moving to upstate or Detroit, looking for. But I grew up here, so I want to stay here. <laughs> So for me, what's at stake is the, the, the character of this city, you know, and, and I would like it to remain a place that's hospitable to um, immigrants, my parents are immigrants, and who, who are able to find a way to, to make it. Um, so for me, the question is, is this going to be, remain a vibrant, rich, diverse uh, ecosystem of the city that I grew up in? Um, or is it going to become a completely generic, uh, you know, Las Vegas.